to Ducascopy TV. Now, in an uncertain financial climate, finding alternative investments becomes even more important. Therefore, it might not be such a surprise that one company in the UK is selling beds for $175,000. But is an investment in a good night's sleep really the way to secure a successful financial future? Joining me in the studio is Chris Thomas to discuss. Chris, thank you very much for coming in. Thank you for having me. Now, let's talk about these beds. Savoir beds, $175,000 price tag. Can you yes. talk me through it, please? Yes. Last month, Savoir Beds, the handmade bed company for the Savoy Hotel in London, launched their new bed range. And this is the Royal Bed at $175,000 US dollars. Now, it's a lot of money, but it's a fantastic piece of furniture. It's handcrafted. It's got many intricate luxuries. You can have your own crest embroidered on it in silk. And within this four poster bed is a really luxurious and soft mattress. Inside the mattress is layers of horse's hair, cashmere and silk. Okay, so it sounds very fancy, very intricate, very luxurious, but $175,000, most professionals who need a, a good night's sleep, don't get me wrong, it does help, but they can't really afford this price tag, so what can the rest of us mere mortals do? Okay, well, a handmade bed should be considered as an investment. The definition of an investment is a long-term buy an asset for long term, hoping to make a gain on that asset. Now, for a bed, you don't make a gain. However, a handmade bed is a high quality indirect investment. A restful night's sleep is extremely important, not only for your body, but for your mental well-being. And take, for example, a finance professional. You wake up feeling refreshed, and the next day you make a great investment decision or you make a very bad investment decision. Now right away that bed can pay for itself. The average handmade bed should start at around 4,000 US dollars. Now for 4,000 US dollars, you've got to look at that as a 10 to 15 year investment. Breaking that down, total cost per night is only around 1,000, sorry, one US dollar or perhaps one Swiss franc. And when you consider in Geneva or Zurich or anywhere in Switzerland, people are happy to spend five or six Swiss francs for a cup of coffee. One Swiss franc extra per night is not a big investment, especially when that gives you the sensation of sleeping on a five star hotel bed every single night. OK, so we can understand that we will all be well rested if we have one of these fantastic beds and it could you know, lead to future success inadvertently. But is the price tag really justified? What sort of materials, what is actually involved in one of these really expensive beds? In terms of the Savoir beds, that their royal bed is essentially a bespoke item with lots of intricate designs and that's where they're justifying their high cost. Now for a normal handmade bed at around four or five, six thousand US dollars, it depends on the luxury quality of the, the materials inside. So you have lots of pocket springs gently nested beside each other. And in doing so, they don't, you don't have the sensation of feeling your partner tossing and turning through the night. So there's one nice advantage. But you've, on top of that, you've got layers of luxury fillers. Now, these layers are generally lamb's wool, cashmere, silk, sometimes horses hair. And that's where the expense of the mattress really comes in. So importantly, these fillings are all natural. And because they're natural, they breathe with your body and allow the mattress to breathe and control and regulate the temperature of, of your sleep through the night. And that's a big advantage as well. OK, so as we said, a good night's sleep is very important for everyone's professional career. If we don't have the £175,000, and I, uh, dollars, sorry, and I do understand the Savoir beds are in limited edition anyway, but mm -hmm. if, do you have any top tips for people who are looking for something that may be more in their budget? Yes. OK, top tip number one would be consider your overall investment. It's not necessary to spend $175,000. In fact, most of us don't have that to spend on a bed. However, in the region of four to 10 or $15,000, you get very, very nice beds. Now, when you break that down onto a cost per night basis, it's one, two, perhaps three US dollars. It's not actually a lot of money. 
Tip number two would be consider the size of the bed. It's important to have the largest bed you can possibly fit into your room without it looking too big for your room. With that, it's important you have extra space so you're not feeling your partner getting in and out of bed or tossing and turning through the night. Tip number three would be look at the materials within the bed. It's important to have luxury natural materials. So materials like cotton, lamb's wool, cashmere, silk and horses hair. All natural, all breathable and very comfortable to sleep on. And remember, buy the biggest bed that you can afford over the lifetime of the bed. With any handmade luxury bed, you're purchasing the Aston Martin of the bed world. Fantastic. I'm sure, Chris, with all your, your facts, your top tips, that we'll have a great night's sleep. Thank you very much for your insights today. Thank you for inviting me in. No problem. Well, there you go, something a little bit different in the Ducoscopy studio, but it does show you to invest in your future by investing in a good night's sleep. Bye for now.